In the year 1985, something extraordinary surfaced in the world of science and technology. A paper was published in the prestigious AI magazine by a NASA scientist named Rick Briggs, and it shook both the scientific and linguistic communities to their core. The title of the paper alone was enough to raise eyebrows. Knowledge representation in Sanskrit and artificial intelligence. In this study, Briggs made a claim that sounded almost unbelievable. NASA, the very institution synonymous with rockets, space shuttles and futuristic technology, was seriously researching Sanskrit, an ancient Indian language to explore its potential in developing artificial intelligence. Yes, you heard that correctly. A language spoken thousands of years ago, carved into palm leaves and echoed in temples, was being studied for deployment in the technologies of tomorrow. At first glance, this might seem like a bizarre connection, why would a space agency racing toward interplanetary exploration pause to look backward at a language of antiquity? But that is where the story becomes even more fascinating. The progress of any civilization is deeply tied to the development of its language. And when we turn our gaze to Sanskrit, we find a system so refined, so precise and so logical that even the most advanced computer scientists of today struggle to replicate its efficiency. Sanskrit was not just a means of communication in the ancient Hindu world, it was a carefully designed structure for thought itself. Thousands of years ago, scholars like Panini meticulously defined rules of grammar and syntax that made Sanskrit almost like a programming language in its own right. Unlike modern spoken languages that often bend and break their own rules, Sanskrit follows a rigorously systematic structure. Sentences can be formed with extraordinary clarity, leaving virtually no room for ambiguity. Imagine a human language where each statement could be understood in exactly one way, no confusion, no double meaning. Doesn't that sound strikingly similar to how computers process instructions? This is exactly what drew NASA's attention. Computers thrive on precision. A single misplaced symbol in code can break an entire program. Modern languages like English are rich and expressive, but they are also riddled with ambiguities. A phrase can have multiple interpretations depending on context, tone or culture. Sanskrit, on the other hand, was engineered with clarity in mind. Every word, every verb, every conjugation follows a pattern that is as close to mathematical perfection as language can get. Now here's a shocking fact. Studies have suggested that nearly 97% of the world's languages are directly or indirectly influenced by Sanskrit. This isn't just about a handful of borrowed words. It points to the possibility that Sanskrit once formed a linguistic backbone of global communication in ways we are only beginning to understand. If this is true, then Sanskrit wasn't just a regional language of ancient India. It may have been the mother script of human civilization, designed to transmit not just words, but structured knowledge across generations. Think about this, modern AI researchers spend years trying to build systems that can store, retrieve and represent knowledge without confusion. But the ancients, thousands of years ago, already had a language that could encapsulate vast amounts of meaning in a concise, precise way. Could it be that our ancestors knew something we are only now rediscovering? Rick Briggs certainly thought so. His paper laid out that Sanskrit could provide a natural framework for knowledge representation in artificial intelligence systems. In simpler terms, NASA believed Sanskrit might hold the key to teaching machines how to think in structured ways. Imagine a future where the intelligence of computers, robots and even space probes is powered not by English or binary code alone, but by the ancient verses of Sanskrit. 
The implications are mind-boggling. Was Sanskrit designed only for poetry and scripture, or was it in fact an early technology, a tool far ahead of its time? If modern AI and quantum computing begin to draw inspiration from it, then the ancient sages may well have been the world's first coders, embedding knowledge in linguistic algorithms that we are just beginning to decode. And so, a paper published in 1985 reminds us of something startling. The future sometimes lies not just in looking ahead, but in rediscovering the wisdom buried in our past. Sanskrit, once the language of saints and scholars, could very well become the language of machines, bridging the gap between human consciousness and artificial intelligence.